Welcome back everyone. We're gonna end our turn right now. We have many enemies to worry about. We're still traveling around the map. Yeah, I always get myself messed up with all the treaties because evidently they don't tell you that you're breaking a treaty until you do. You have to look at your agreements first. So I'll be more mindful to do that. We'll keep that in mind for sure, but it happens, you know. Last chance for what do you want now? Unfortunately, we my buddy, gratitude. big brother, Jin Empire, says no to you. They're like, yeah, about that. Kind of want to kill you. The Shi Bing system. The Shi Bing hereditary troops serve for life upon their retirement. They can assume that same responsibility. Thus, the military continues. Oh, really? Huh. I have actually have never heard of that. I'll have to read about that. I'm really curious about it now. I just like to learn what I can. Excuse me. I'm trespassing. Maybe they're trespassing. Have you ever thought? No, they never thought of that. Okay, let's move over here now. We'll go to Shongyong because I'm not in trouble. I work so hard to maintain my reliability. That damn, nothing. All right, we're going to come over here now to mass mobilization. We'll unlock more units. And let's go look at my main army led by Sima Ying. Sima Ying is going to keep on pushing up north. Yeah, that's where we're going. As we have people that we need to potentially kill one day. Right, we're heading up. Let's keep on looking around. I've got stuff at Chengdu that I want to upgrade. My salt shaft mine. There we are. Yeah, I know we've been talking a little bit about the balance lately of the game and that towers need to be a little bit stronger later on. They've kind of been nerfed too much and trebuchets don't feel like they really get too much better. They needed to be tweaked down or tuned down is what the terminology is. Towers, I actually didn't really mind towers. You just had to think about how you you approached them but evidently they nerfed them because they didn't want new players to get completely owned in their first fight and to give up on the game but i guess after you know the balance of the game being like that for so long i don't know if that would be really a huge factor but brothers in arms all right she chose not much happier as he should be i've got some new characters in my court i've got so much money to play with it's actually pretty damn sweet a saboteur fejong rank one Wang Fu Chan. No one worthwhile. Hardly anyone worthwhile. Ever, ever, ever. Okay. Again, I've got all this money to spend, and I will be spending it. See, my Ying is going to travel up north. We might even go up the river. We could do that. Oh, yeah. I really want to kill Sima Ying and take all these lands, all these juicy lands up there. Ah, oh, right for the taking. All right. Well, Sima Fang Ning. Where are we going to bring you, lady? I guess we're going to bring you up north, too. We'll always divide it up if we wanted to. Here. March. I'll try to. All right. What else do we have? I've been upgrading all my contested commanders trying to make sure that they have all of their defenses where they... Okay. We need to upgrade the capital. And Shangyong, what are we going to upgrade? Let's see. Yeah. Support would go down. It's at... Okay. That would be minus four. Well, I'm going to upgrade my guest house first. I have money to upgrade Bashi. Livestock estate. And we are good. Having all that money to upgrade stuff just feels incredible. You don't always get that, man. But I get that. I'm going to need a third army now. I mean, it's about time for that. I'll need a third army to help me defend. To help me hold off enemies. Who want to come for me? All right. Loyal versus... Oh, I've got to choose duty. Duty. All right. Me and the wife are like, yeah, let's um, be happy about that. We're getting along. Still traveling up Marching. north. We're not done doing that yet. Everyone goes up north. Okay, Chang'an. What about you? Upgrade that. Sure. Many turns, but a lot of public order. And over here, we'll get rid of corruption in adjacent locations, too. And that's most of what I need to be doing. My other option right now is to build another army in my capital area. I do have two armies up north, and I feel like that's sufficient. But what I really need is another army in Chengdu. Oh, Sima Xing, you're so unhappy. He wants a higher core position, which I do not have. All right, go take the mustering turns. Go help me out. Building up keep. And let me figure out what I want to do with you, Shichul. No, sorry. You're not Shichul. 
see my shing. Yeah, here you are. Okay. I'm going to promote you. All right, there we go. Be happy. No new weapons for you. That's plus four to cunning. You don't need that force. Do any of you need... Ah, oh, you do. Here you go. Enjoy that, Luigi. Now we can end our turn. And begin a new turn. Yeah, we'll Together do. we could return what? wisdom to the land. See my yan. Okay, Li Jian will be angry. I don't want to do that. We withdraw it then. I'm glad they're requesting and not being like, hey, do this, idiot. Fighting the Jin Empire would be a nightmare. That's why I'm gonna go down the route I am currently going down, which will allow me to annex their lands. So I'm just gonna use them for now. That'll be my buffer. A new mission completed. All right, good. Overpopulation. Shu Chul will like me more. Support from artisans too. Another bit of technology completed. An exquisite weapon has been gained. Finally, I don't know what it is yet, but we'll find out in a little bit. A great glaive, and we have a war blade. Oh, hell yeah. Two good weapons. It's new characters in my in my camp. Yeah, I really wish I had more positions to give all of you, but I do not. All right, so you have a weapon. Fung has a weapon. I guess I could, well, how good is your weapon, really? Use a proper weapon for you. Oh my god, I put him at 189. His melee evasion is at 75 now. He's like, try and hit me. Can't catch this. All right. Chief Inspector. Central Army Protector. Shicho. Very powerful. All right, let's see. Guess we're going up the water to go conquer the mountains. I cannot. Yeah, why not? I want to head up the water, man. That's where I'm going today. The wife will come with me. Hell yeah. Going right through, man. The two of us will sell up that river. Go conquer some sweet ass lands. Who's over here? Ho Feng. Young Bing. And we got Sui Chen. Okay. That's who we're looking at. Let me go look at some peace treaties. Become vassal. How about no? I tell the no. Right, more technology. Let's go pick up decentralized military. There we are. And then we can go look at Wudu. We'll go upgrade the capital area in Wudu. They need it. And then after that, we can't upgrade anything. So I'm just going to end my turn. I am a wealthy, wealthy man plying my trade called war. Nah, I'm excited to play more Total War. I'm playing in a different way than I usually do. And I'm enjoying it a lot. I can't wait to go back to the Three Kingdoms, of course, for iconic characters that I grew up with. I really did, too, since I was a little boy. Sima I declared war on Gujin. Let's see who else do we have. Sima Yue, vassalized Sean Yu. Well, no shit. It's a lot of wars. All right. Gather money. I've got money, so we'll do that have a treasury starting at 4,500. Easy. And done. Yeah, see that? Easy enough. It's like, damn, this guy's good. It's like I knew what you wanted from the very beginning. Empress. I'm that Empress pleaser. All right. Make sure we're still fighting some nasty wars. Yeah. I like that. I'm not fighting you. I should be. No. Yeah, let's see Mo Hong. Oh, they took some land. Yeah, whenever I become a higher tier prince, too, the cool part is, is that I'll be able to annex their lands, and I'm getting closer to becoming that grand prince. But then I've got to go. I mean, the regency would be great. The regency, let's see, would give me a lot, really. Small chance to become. I don't know how many other factions are getting that. I don't know if you get that from becoming a vassal. Now, I wonder, can I declare war? Let me go have a look. I know all the entangling alliances are causing issues for me, but... Oh, he's got lands. Oh, shit. He does have lands down there. That's weird. Why do you have lands down there? Fucking weirdo. Alright, what if we declared an alliance war? I don't think I have a treaty with him, do I? That would be pretty cool. So we could change our minds and instead go after Sima Wei since like everyone is a vassal right now. That's Sima Mo, sorry. Get this let's over go back with. over here. Alright, let's see. Feng Shen, Chan Yu, 
That's it. No allies. Nothing. Okay, never mind. We're going to change up our plans a little bit because we're heading over here. I wasn't going to do it originally, but that's too good. Okay, with all that extra money, I can go upgrade over here. My, ooh, look at that. Look at that. 500 income, just straight up. We'll take that industrial tool manufacturer. That's over here, man. Xiong Yong. I've never had so much money to just throw around. It's pretty great. Invoke Council, just for a new mission. Right, that's another overpopulation problem. And I'm getting closer to the capital, too. That's the whole goal, is to take what I can eventually. We cannot ignore your actions any longer. Excuse me. Sima Dan Hong Juro. We cannot ignore your Empire hasn't been this happy with me lately, so I gotta kind of work on that. Let them drag me into wars. It'll be okay. I'm really doing okay, so I'm all right with it. But this must end. Aligned to the five elements. Us. Shit. Crap. Poop. Feces. Dookie. Those are their five elements. I was trash talking them. I'm I'm a fucking small child. Anyway, Sima I invited Wang Shen into their alliance. You liberated Sima Dan. Coming of age. Really? What? Are you my child? We have a new child, Sima Chong. We killed Chong and we were like, let's let's bring him back, man. There we go. And that gives me 15 prestige. Putting me closer. Those missions, man, are why I'm so powerful. I'm so close to being a grand or a sorry, yeah, yeah. A grand prince. I'm currently a prince. I got that at 299. What year is it? <laughs> what year is it? Oh my god, it's been years. Holy shit. How old am I? I feel okay, that's why I didn't want to pick old people. I'm 34 now. Oh boy. Oh, there's my faction air. Hello. Let's see. Huh. Where did you even come from? I don't remember having all these kids. No, that's my son though. 18 years old. Look at this motherfucker. Oh, yeah, Sima Poo. Oh, he's gonna murder some people. Oh, it's gonna be good. It's, yeah. So you'll go after Anding Farmland. You'll come over here, wife. That's what I call her now. Wife! <laughs> Get over here. All right, let's go over to Shuofang. That'll be in a couple of turns. A lot of characters are jumping into my court. I'm probably going to get my son to go build an army now. Okay, character developments are right. We zoom out. Diplomatic status. Don't even know who I'm fighting anymore. The Jin Empire still holds a lot of land. A lot of factions aren't that friendly with me. That's understandable. I like how my capital's all the way in Chengdu. All right, let's see. That's my boy. Right over here. Caution! Let the horse peel with laughter. Okay, do I have any arm? I do have armor for you, by the way. Enjoy. Yeah, looking tough, looking tough. There's your new weapon. I don't have a mount for you. I do have that for you for more, you know, dodging and other things. Here's a stone rat. He's like, oh, gee, thanks, Dad. A stone rat. This is what I wanted. All right, take your vengeance. You'll take fatigue resistance. Sounds amazing. We'll take fury as well, I think. Well, then again, take the 5% replenishment for your command, but that puts him at just enough. Composed, ambitious, okay. Well, he's my son. Composed, that's good. Indecisive, not great. Experience goes down, but at least it decreases his <laughs> ambition to gain independence. All right. Got a few things going on there. A few weird things. Unding has need to upgrade as well. Done. Bashi, what can I... Oh, I can upgrade you. My god. I'll take the food production just straight up. Give me all that sweet, sweet food. Yeah, I'll figure out who I'm going to put into his armor. I would like to have... Let's see. Who do I not really have? You are a stumbling block to China. Are you it? No. Okay, I guess we're fighting the map. Let's do it. About time, I might even need another army after that. Accept peace and trouble us. Sorry, big we were big bro generous. says no. Looks like I'm fighting the map again. Such is my life. We'll have to see my way. I'm pretty far over here. Even if they conquered peace. some stuff, they wouldn't be able to get through all this of it, man. Is an insult. It's impossible. Victory for me will come one day. 
That means everyone's coming to fight me. Okay, let's see. I think I'm pretty... I'm almost spent on technology until I get to tier 3. Trades gaining. Okay. Philanthropic over here for Lu Yun. We've got traits gained. Okay. Character development. I need to go check on those. I keep getting to. I, th I think a lot of factions are losing their good characters. I've got a lot of new rivals. Other princes. Sima Yong has a new capital. Okay. Let's see. Yeah. I know you're being hostile. It's very rude, by the way. at enemies I haven't seen the orange one I don't think all right well let's go get my son to pick up some new stuff I've got to do it I think okay well, let's see what are we going to give him I'm ooh, fucking cataphracts are you shitting me absolutely I'm going to give him cataphracts my god now these Xiong Marauders hit like the Dickens, so I do want to bring them in too. I know you've got militia over here, but I don't really care for them too much. I think we're gonna change that up. Do I have anyone else that you can bring in? Not really. Let me go look at who I can hire. I've got like one thousand left. He's rank four. You're rank one. It's got to be younger people. It's got to be. Let's see. He's actually not too bad. Geology. Rank four, but we already have a warrior. Yao Shin, rank one. Okay, okay. I can see my nobles right now that I have. Looks like my son will be of my other son will be of age in two years. And we're doing fine, me and my wife. We've had quite a few children since. We've had I've had three children with her. See my eyes over here. 34 years old, Sima Wei is 48, much older, still incredibly powerful. He's at 184 for his instinct. Fucking insane. Alright. Resist the chaos of change. I'm gonna get her to head over to Onding. To the Better head the wrong desire. way. I didn't realize that pathway would not lead me to where I needed to go. Alright, so we'll head up north. We'll go conquer there. I'm gonna try to build what forces I can down here. Sima Mo is pretty close by. That does concern me slightly. I'll see what I can build. I've got money to spend on my military for once. I've invested so much into my lands that their defenses should be rather stark and troubling for the enemy. Now we just get to wait for a little bit. Sima Yong vassalized Sima Don. Okay. The mission completed. At the end of this, though, I'm going to have all the charitable for Pong. Pong is such a good guy. Love Pong. All right. More buildings completed. My income stays very high. Let's go to On Ding Farmland. That's where I wanted to go originally to finally get rid of my lack of completion for On Ding. My wife just conquered On Ding. They're just all over the map, and I just happen to be in the corner. I'm not, like, in the midst of Mom. I'm kind of out in that corner. Doing what I do best, which is annoy people. Alright, let's go over to right Shuo Fong. I'll get her go to go to horse pastures, probably. Jin Empire is certainly getting pushed back. That's a huge problem. I concede that point. And now it's time for Sun over here to recruit more. I really wanted to have those young marauders, so we're going to grab two of those. I want to change up these other lancers into Lance Cav. Good for flanking weak with missile attacks. That's going to give him such a crazy mounted group. But my god, imagine what he's going to be able to do. I, I just spent a lot of money. I think the leads cost way too much. Way too much. Because it's so hard to get them in. And they're pretty good, but it's why like you just end up not picking them up because it costs so much, right? Alright, let's see. We do not have any way to... We need to get rid of some of that. Let me see. I could just turn that if I wanted to. I make a lot of money from industry. Silks too. Silks too. It's for noble support. I don't make anything from commerce, so that's a tough one to sell. Really? Let's see. I like the funds. All right. Well, we can wait then. I suppose we can wait, but I can upgrade that pine woodcutter camp. That's over in Shangyong. 
yeah everyone has like a pretty good weapon i think most people have a pretty good weapon you've got a pretty good weapon you don't really need a good weapon i didn't even give you the better mount beloved governor all right let's end your turn Told him we could like take the princes. Drown in our people's blood. Who? Okay, Simo Young. Very well. Goodbye. Oh well, he rejected that. So. <laughs> no, when I can start, if I become the regent, oh, the power, the power will feel pretty good. We offer you peace. I can't this do any of this, man. I can only acknowledge it and just be like, yo, maybe. Okay, we have a new weapon. Kindred Gion. So if I wanted to switch my son's weapon to that, I could, but I'm not going to. Oh, 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 hello, see my way. We did it. Holy shit. They're telling me I don't have a chance. He is so strong. Rank 5 for Gong Shun Hong. Liu Shen. I feel like you're over in the main campaign too, and you're just as awful. Look at his crazy armor. Oh my god, I want all of it. Now, for those weapons, I'm gonna kill them. <laughs> I gotta tell you, those are pretty good. He's got a lot of infantry. Cataphracts? Man, fuck you and your cataphracts. I'm going in. Probably should have uh, exchanged a few of my units, but I did not. Feeling today, we're gonna have some interesting times. Oh yeah, it's gonna be fairly bloody. Oh god. Okay, so we know that we have a trebuchet that's gonna lure them to me. That's gonna be step one. Just lure them straight to me, take out what we can of their units. I've got, let's see, charge resistance, 900% with my shields, very nice. We'll use that extensively. We need a thicker formation, though. My crossbows will be instrumental in wiping out anything they have. Mounted units, we'll do what we can, but there's only so much that we can do. They have fucking cataphracts. So we'll try our best over here to hit them hard. And I don't have a lot of combative commanders, so this should be, again, very interesting. I'm going to try my best to keep it safe, support my units. Here's some archer militia. We'll put that over here on that flank. We'll use some flaming arrows just for the hell of it. And what's over here? Some more mounted units. I really should have changed up my build, I think. But I went kind of crazy with that. I was so busy trouncing everyone else. I was like, oh, I don't need to do that. No, I kind of do. All right, let's see about luring them over. Don't think we're going to take see my way out or Liu Shin. They're very tired, though. That's the upside. Okay, what I really want to hit over here are these crossbowmen. That's what I really want to hit. And while I hit that, I want to kind of move my formation just a little bit like that. While I continue to hit them with my trebuchet, which is rank 10. And not nearly as powerful as it used to be. Come on. It's another hit on the crossbows. Let's hit these crossbows back here. Let's hit these over here. They're all spread out. We're at least keeping them fairly mixed up. They have horsemen that are going to be on the way, too. Not very keen on that. I'm going to use my melee evasion once they're up here. And I'm going to debuff them. As best as I can. Oh yeah, this should be nasty. Let me get up my crossbows real quick. Just to have them help out. Because we're going to need the love and help. They're already about to attack me, it looks like. Oh no. Let's go hit them. It's Archer Militia, which I'm not too worried about. It's just everything else that I'm fairly worried about. Okay, these are all of the nasty cataphracts. At least one group of them. I need to go look at those cataphracts in, in a little bit. How many have you killed now? You've killed 27. Been okay, are my crossbows actually attacking, though? Are they 
doing the deed. We have more gold than they do. It looks like so far we are winning that exchange. What's over here? That's true infantry, heavy sword infantry. We can go try to hit them. Let's see what we have over here. I'm going to have to try to go after them. What I have. I'm going to bring up these archer militia. Right, go hit these mounted crossbows. Are you in guard mode? You are in guard mode. Good. I hope that my Dallas sword guards can hold up for now. I'm really scared about fighting Sima Way. The dude is fucking terrifying. All right, let's go hit this group. We'll get my other crossbows to hit their crossbows. We've got another group over here that we're hitting, and then I'll get my last group to go attack. Let's see, that's G Militia. We could certainly hit them. We so chose to do that. Spear guards. I would rather you hit the heavy infantry. The Yeah, these guys over here have no shields, but they are incredibly damaging. So they're weak against missile attacks. We can use that against them and hit them. So let's see where that leads us all. Shichol could probably beat that guy. I would imagine he's able to. All right, I'm going to bring up my leader close by real quick. As we unfortunately charge in. Yeah, not a fan, buddy. Not a fan, but that's what we're doing today. And over here, melee evasion up. He does get tenacity of still. Looks like he did knock him down. That's one hit on an enemy leader. Let's go look at where we're targeting now. Okay, so you're hitting two infantry. Good work. Their archer militia has killed very few. Let's just go hit more two infantry. I'm going to bring back you two over here. I'm going to let you hit these spear guards on the right flank just use your standard arrows i've killed 355 with my trebuchet let's come over here and attack now where they have big thick groups all right so now we can debuff all of them now they're debuffed and hopefully we can kill some of these cataphracts we'll, we'll want to catch them here in this quagmire but we'll see how that plays all right let's go hit these other two infantry men let's go hit let's see what else do they have they've got let's just focus on that one true infantry group the way he's going to do so much damage so i've just got to watch out for him all right let's just charge in with that group let's keep on attacking killed how many they have 86 left my swordsmen are doing okay there's not a lot of enemies to worry about here well what about that one let's see that's melee evasion that that goes up so we could actually switch all of you to melee evasion and in a nice circle formation so unlike my brother i'm using formations and taking my time He's going ape shit and is trying to just kill me. Oh shit, he's actually winning that duel though. Oh no. Well, that's really bad. Stand ready. Really thought we had a Do shot of winning that one. I the was wrong. Unit, what okay, so it looks like we've got another one. Archers, I'm going to bring them over here to attack. That'll work out. My crossbows, I'm going to use them to further destroy my enemies. Let's see how we're going to do that. These two crossbows will move back. You will move back. Trebuchet will continue to attack. Right over here. Go hit the cataphracts if you don't mind. Come back slightly. Unless you all want to hit see my way. He's gonna kill all of you. I am outmatched. Retreat might be best. Yeah. It looks like it might be. I don't think he's gonna be able to make it. I thought maybe he could. But Run, it's just going to leave. I shall have my vengeance. Yeah, it's time for you to go, buddy. Oh, man. At least their champion is quite wounded. Or that would have been awful, too. He's at 4.6k. I guess we'll continue to focus on his infantry. Even though I... Well, let's go hit that cataphrag group. That cataphrag group, if it gets to me, could be devastating to all of us. very least right now I've got a nice range advantage but I've got to make sure that I kind of double up on that let's go over here and debuff them we'll come over here and wait too Perhaps, but not today. okay it looks like he's routing as well that's a really good thing that's what we need let's come over here and kill these cataphracts then I'm gonna come over here and not really a huge deal but he'll at least he'll be close and supportive 
60 but wasted 74 already my god what a nightmarish human being the men have no ammunition that's why no one would invite you to group parties dude you're a freak all right come over here go get my other swordsmen we're gonna bring them out so keep them fighting come over here and flank this group of g militia that's what we need and it, my archer militia will continue to attack let's go hit this group of true spearmen you see that my saber militia has one so far we're still fighting over here i can't debuff anyone see my way still killing at everyone i'm gonna bring back these groups and just try to get them away from him i don't think we can though i don't think that's possible let's go ahead this group of chu all right that means that i have two groups that are available to be used over here i have one that's available to be used over here that was a nice little way to kind of bend them into my side tactically right now i think we have certainly a nice advantage let's go hit this group that's charging at me yeah, they're coming at me right now let's see 419 for the kills that we have let's go over here and hit more i'm gonna get everyone to go after steam away just to kind of hold him off he's 157 again terrifying all right we wiped out that group let's go hit some more of them let's go after these enemies close by okay hold up I'll get one over here I'll get you two to kind of come over here I think they're all beginning to waver and break they're wavering let's go after my brother because we have to we kind of have to there isn't a choice okay you two if you want to go after Gong Soon Hong that would be great I don't know how much we're gonna be able to take these guys He's at 8k. I don't know if my horseman can get him, but we're gonna see. 5.2k. We just have to wound him because he's too strong. He the killed 189. The enemy general is fallen. They okay, we got no match. at least one of them. The most important one. Why would you stop attacking? I don't understand that. Let's go get Hong as well. The enemy general falls. Okay. That was a nightmare. But we completely wiped him out. Why? Because, again, I'm using my ranged plan that I had for this campaign. People were like, why do you have two strategists? Because, one, I began with that, so I didn't really have too much of a choice in the very beginning financially. But, two, I adapted that into just, just my range plan. And Shi Chou getting rid of that one guy, Pong, was... Or not uh, Pong. Um, what's his name? Liu Xin, right. I lost 710. I gained a new ancillary. That's more replenishment for me. In service of the empire. On the march. When drawing a bow, I can't reach you. I cannot. And he's only wounded for one turn. Wow. Contemplate all. I need to come back and replenish, I think. I will have to... Let desire no, I'm going to let him stay down there, I suppose. I was going to have him come back up north, but that's okay. Okay, that's my salt mine. What other buildings do I have? I'm gonna build my military forages. We have industry. We have 1.1 million in Hanjong. So we're, ne we're nearly capped out. That's more noble support if I need it. At least food if I do that. No, I like my food where it's at. And Chengdu. Go get my coin maker. I think that'll do it. I think that did do it. Now we can move up north. She's going to be able to go take out the horse pastures while replenishing. I'll be a little bit beat up, but at least we took out a major enemy army. Sorry, brother. But I'm better than you are. Plus two cunning. What about you? What do you have? Plus, yeah, you got a lot. He's only at 153. Uji is actually 168. So let's give him extra cunning. Now he's at 172. We've got all the supplies in the world, man. Okay, he's coming down. He's already back, so I get to go Together beat him again. Kind of have to, don't I? I don't really have a choice. We're just going to be fighting the map at, at this point. But again, they're very rich and powerful, so I'm just, just going to stick with them. 
It's going to be a nightmare when I have to annex their lands. Oh, I'll be doing that to the west with like one little group. Oh, he actually outran me. How about that? All right, technology done. Unsave resource. If I do that, I'll get subtle. No, arrest him. Might alignment. I cannot reach him, but I can gain more replenishment while I'm up here. Yeah, he's back up. Still laughing, huh? Still laughing. All right, let's get rid of all that business. We're going to, again, just go over to the horse pastures. Our son, Simapu, is ready to go. 19 years old now. Still hasn't fought. Okay, I'm going to give you Sima Xing. Very powerful guy. I suppose you do need a planner. That guy is very powerful. Rank 4 with all that. But who do we have? Who do we have? Could just give you Qi Xing instead. Yeah, we could be more volatile with that group. I think I like that idea. So we're going to do that instead. Let me go look at all of their... Oh, yeah. Not all, all of them are very happy. That's unfortunate. Like, we need to give you a new item. There you go, pal. Plus two cunning. I mean, we might as well give it to someone. Someone's getting some more cunning. All right. Some more instincts for you. Sure, you lose a big chunk of your expertise, but now you deal a lot more damage. Kishing already has that. He's got armor. No mount for him. I've got no followers for him. Go look at what I'm going to give him for his military choices here. Noble supports. We're looking at perception. That would be intensity. Diligence. More melee evasion. Bravery. Charge negate. I like that. And I want to deal more damage, though. There's more instinct. He's intimidating, so that actually does help. He actually does a lot of damage for what he is. Which is a sentinel. Alright, so we have our new army. I think I might change up a few of the units. Let's see what we can give you, pal. Alright, so we're looking at Dao Sword Guard. Which costs a bit more, but they're very good. You've got Chu Spearman, which is awesome. I'll let you keep those. Just get rid of the horsemen. Yeah, I've only had so many options down here, man. Yeah, that'll do it. It'll take two turns, but then we'll have a full army. Then we can let him go fight. Somewhere. We'll bring him somewhere. I just had to bring him up in Chengdu. That just felt right. Okay, we're done now. I'm getting 4,000 per turn. Not as much, but... I'm all right with it. I wonder if he could start beating some of my garrisons. I intentionally upgraded a lot of stuff up here, so he might not be able to do that. He might just be able to beat his Seize faction. This chance. A stubborn refusal. You can see my UA, dude. I've never seen... Like, I don't even think in my Yuan Shao fighting days in the early game, I've ever seen that many that we've had to really contend with. That's pretty wild. Draw okay, so she's coming over here to the horse pastures. That's what she's going to be all about. She's going to... Easily take that little tiny garrison. It's on a very developed Those location. Who oppose harmony must be crushed. That would be assassin. So Fong's been wounded. Jesus. This damn events, man. Ooh, look at that. Great for her. Might give that to my wife. I would give her some more formations. There we go. Fong will be back in one turn. I can't reach the guy. I'll never be able to, to catch up with him. But what we can do instead, we can just go after other towns. Yeah, I'll never be able to catch up to him. He's got such a tiny force, too. It's pretty funny. He's unable to, re to replenish. Let's go look at what we have in my other army, my third army. Who's over here? Oh, look who it is. I'm going to have to move. I'm going to come over here to Qingdu Salt Mine. I don't know how my farmland is for a defense. Not possible. Let's see. So I've got to go fight you. You're the faction leader. You've been there for a long time. Totally get it, man. Totally get it. Let's go look over here. Let's see. That would be Hanjong. Let's go upgrade that. Very cheap. Just timber. Oh, no. That wasn't Hanjong. My bad. Anyway. Taking it anyway. Okay. So if we're up here... If I take that location, 
can't issue anyone there. I'm gonna upgrade these horse pastures right away. Still have money to upgrade, so that feels good. I'm gonna end my turn now. Don't know where Way is going. He's like fleeing now. He's like, oh, I'm getting the fuck out of here. Leaving his people to die. That's pretty fucked up, dude. Come on. You're just rude. I'm gonna go hunt Chong down now. He's gonna die. We're about to take over two locations. Let's see. So you two are fighting? Ooh, the Jin Empire. Okay, okay. There is cunning in caution. At least I get to conquer up here. Taking over more. We outwitted them. And this location let's suits see. our plans. We'll bring out our other army. And then we have our son who's gonna move more towards his army. Attention. It looks to be way too weak for them to even really contend with me. That's pretty sad. Oh, yeah. It's way too small. My son just got his first taste of battle. And we're going to call it here for right now. I do have to go. So leave a like and comment down below. Look forward to even more battling tomorrow. So until then.